You call me devious But you don't understand that all I I thought my jokes were bad. What's up guys, Sal here. So back in October, it was discovered that Samsung had filed a new patent for a pressure sensitive fingerprint scanner, something we are expecting to see on one of its 2017 devices. However, there was no news about whether the patent had been granted or not until today. So it's been confirmed that Samsung has been granted the aforementioned patent. As for what the patent details, there will be up to 12 pressure points on the display, which will not only allow you to unlock your device, but to also access secure applications, contacts or messages. For example, sliding on the screen to access Samsung Pay could also trigger a fingerprint scan. That means that users are automatically logged in while opening the app, making mobile payments even easier than it already is. It can also be used to restrict access to apps and gallery. The patent document states that if the fingerprint authentication is unsuccessful, the image gallery will show limited photos. It's only after successful authentication that the user will be able to see all the images in the gallery. The same kind of security will be available for accessing messages and contacts. If the fingerprint authentication is unsuccessful, the user will not be able to see all the contacts and messages. An app like online banking that carries sensitive information of the user will show different screens depending on who accesses the display. So yeah, the on-screen fingerprint technology is not just for unlocking the phone, it has many many applications and this may be the next big thing for smartphones across the board. So of course that said, does this mean the Galaxy S9 is getting the in-display fingerprint scanner? Probably not. Recent reports have revealed that the fingerprint scanner will be placed below the dual camera on the back of the S9 and S9 Plus. Hence the Galaxy S9 Duo may not feature the in-display fingerprint scanner. But I'll be keeping my fingers crossed to see this technology arrive on the Galaxy Note 9. So yeah, let me know what you think about the in-display fingerprint scanner in the comments down below and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out. Okay.